if you're having a hard time sliding open the lock on your DS160 or 161, take a flat headed screwdriver and you can insert it into this gap here. Once you do that, you can twist it open and it'll help slide it open. Now once you lift up here, sometimes if you have a lot of sand underneath the C-shaped piece, you're gonna have to take the same screwdriver and kind of pry it up just a little bit. That should let you twist it open and remove it from the head. All right, sometimes salt and sand can get underneath the locking mechanism of a DS160 or 161 strobe. Um, and here we're gonna clean this one today. So just as you normally would remove the battery pack, take it off of the strobe head. And what we're gonna do is remove this C-shaped piece so that we can get underneath it. And in order to do that, what we wanna do is push in on the locking mechanism and then pull up on that piece and it'll simply slide out. Now it'll expose the surface area, it could be dirty. I'll take a microfiber cloth and clean it out. And for the hard to reach areas, we can use a Q-tip to get all the salt and sand out of there. While depressing the locking mechanism. Now in order to put it back on, you'll wanna make sure that this rotates and is parallel with the opening. And at this face, is pointed towards the switch. Now when we press again, we can take the C-shaped piece, drop it back down on.